Hey, it's Ronnie. Uh, I'm still kind of bummed about the dude that died on the highway. Innocent bystander. One dude's vehicle stalled. He was trying to help get that vehicle off that four-lane highway where they drive 70 miles an hour. And somebody else that went and just blasted them all, and he was killed instantly in between the vehicles. The other two were in hospitals. But the innocent bystander that stopped and then got out and was trying to get him off the road, 61-year-old Rogers something, he never fucking came home. He's dead as fuck. And I said I could feel it a mile away when it happened, and I was one mile away when that happened exactly. Just crossed the freaking section, and I didn't hear it or see it, but I sure as hell felt it. And, it, you know, I talked about it in that one video, and then I sent uh, just a picture in Norfolk Daily News and I heard more about it but yeah it sucks it's, uh, I said being an old soul is cool shit you feel all the loving energy you feel freedom energy you feel God and the universe's energy and angels but you also feel evil and you also feel death but if you ever feel fear you're not an old soul you don't be stupid you don't go skydive out of an airplane without a parachute. <laughs> no. <laughs> I believe I can fly. No. But it, 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 like I said, through the video I showed about going through a mirror, I told you what happened. You can go back to the yeah, mirrors and stuff, and that's where evil comes at me. The entities did for a while and tried to kick the shit out of me. Hang on. Go through the mirror. There's no turning back. There's no bullshit. You know, there's no doubt, there's no fear, there's no nothing, or you don't remain an old soul very fucking long, and your energy's gone forever. So, yeah, it's still dragging me down, but I did get some cool shit, something cool in the mail yesterday, which is... Country folks know what this is, Platt, Staten County, Platt and Directory of who owns every piece of ground in the county... And if it's under a trust or a corporation, Stanton County 2022 just got that yesterday in the mailbox. But I want to show you something cool before you show you that. And it's not really cool, but I've mentioned it before. Here is what I got. Uh, let's see the date it was made here. Focus you buck. Can you see that? 5-13-2022. There you go. 5-13-22. Notice of valuation change, not a tax statement of the legal description. Lot number, Volbrecht, lot split, boom, boom, boom. See the name? Ron Volbrecht. That means, apparently, <laughs> which I had a feeling, but I know it does. When you get a notice of an evaluation change on your tax rate, that means you own the ground, okay? That means you own it. That means my name is right here. It's sent to me. That means I own the ground. Here's the other kicker. Just for reinforcement, the plat map just showed up, you know, and they had to make this in February. Probably start getting it ready and printed out. I'll show you something really neat here. It's, it's not coincidence. It's just evil. But, you know, I, 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 yeah, you'll get it. Okay, I don't know if I can zoom in this close on here or not. But right under, right above that red line. Uh, see if you can focus. Maybe if I turn the light off. Focus, you bitch. Uh, it's as small as it'll go. If I zoom in more. Uh, that's making it brighter. Well, you'll just have to trust me. Right here, the second one says Ron Volbrecht, 39 acres in one lot, and then Ron Volbrecht, 5 acres in another lot. When it's in a plat map, that means it's, I own the deed. I own the ground, the title, the deed. That That's, that's my ground. Right? You want to know the kicker? Here's the kicker. I don't have a deed yet. I should have had a deed the minute it was signed through. But 
I'm not an executor of the trust or have power of attorney on my dad's estate. Okay? It should have been done. I should have had a deed in my hand. I'm gonna see, once I see the deed and I do get it, which I don't have yet, but I'm already been notified and everybody else is, I own it and I've been notified my tax rate's going up next year. I don't even have the deed in my hand yet. <laughs> and it was all surveyed last April or May, a year over a year and a half ago. The deed's been floating around between a family member, supposedly, and and, and, the, and then the attorney, and then the county, and then the family member in Idaho again, and that it does have a uh, power of attorney and the uh, uh, trustee of the freaking whatever junk. Been holding it up for months and months. She texted me almost a month ago, said, hey, even our, our estate attorney, not my estate attorney, the one they hired, that's playing games, but I, I know him. If I, I ain't gonna go talk to him. It'll cost me two hundred fifty dollars an hour, or two hundred minimum, just to call him on the phone. And then that's gonna come out of my pocket because here's the kicker. I own the ground. I'm sure. <laughs> I'm not positive, but I'm thinking I own the ground before. Here's what they did to me. They took my rent money. From my nephew, well, my sister and my twin brother, one of them, they're the only two executors left. They didn't tell Ronnie Moi in basically, I believe it was about May, because they said, hold off. No more money. I said, the rent money comes to Ronnie. I, you know, I own the ground now. It don't go back in the trust, even if they want it to, because they're playing games with the trust and, and the money that's going in and out. I should have got about ten grand rent, and after I paid the taxes from last year, I should have still had like $6,500 left. Because you're a year behind on the farm on paying the estate, real estate taxes. But the rent would have been ten grand, give or take you know, a couple hundred, and about $3,500 for the real estate taxes, the land taxes. I never, and I told my nephew that ran it, don't give it to nobody, just hang loose till I get the deed and stuff, it don't matter. Hang on to the money, I know you're good for it, if it's freaking October, November. Well, nobody bothered to call me, text me, ask me or nothing, but they sure got a hold of Corey that's renting the ground, and they told him, we need the rent, and you take it and make a check out to Melvin Volbeck Trust again. <laughs> no shit. I have no rent, no nothing, no deed in my hand anywhere, but it's state, Stanton County. It's all notarized somewhere, sometime. I have no deed to my land, even around my home, where nobody can hold a hammer over me anymore. And... On the 39 over there. But my acre and stuff I've owned since uh, 1992. And my dad told me he'd give me the deed within a month and have a title over. And he lied and never did. And he just said, oh, put it in my will. Well, he didn't have a will. He just had to trust. And yeah, that's why he had an acre. And then I had to get, switch over five acres and all this and have that hanging over my head. And yeah, it's evil. Evil people are evil, evil, evil. But yeah, it's quite, I find it quite interesting I don't have a deed in my hand or the title of the land in my hand yet or any court documents that state I own it, but Stanton County plat map says I own it. Stanton County tax assessors say I own it. I don't have a deed yet, and my sister texted me and told me I should be getting that deed within a week, about a month ago right now. And then she got kind of crabby, you know, about... Oh, I was private about goodwill wishes to her husband, Dick Hunt. She got all freaky and bitchy. Well, I did tell him something. I texted her something because she tried to call me. I wasn't going to listen to her. I texted her. I said, hey, I have that tax notice in the mail that my tax rate is going up next year on the ground. That means I own this. Where is my freaking deed? You said I should have it in a week. 
And I said, thanks for letting me go. You stole my rent money and had Corey lie to him and made him, told him he had to put it in that trust. Doesn't matter. If I own this ground, me, myself, if that, I, I, that's, they're not giving me the deed yet. I told her, if that land deed, once I do get it, wherever you keep hiding it from me, for some reason, I know why. How about guarantee you that land deed stated it was notarized and certified in probably January or February? And I know they took Corey's rent money, my rent money, from Corey, lied to him, had him put it in that trust again to pay their frickin' estate taxes in about May. I don't have a deed yet. No deed from my sister or the county or the attorneys that the estate attorneys they hired. But it's right here. I know I own it. <laughs> I just I said, and if that date on that deed, I can't do nothing until I have all the paperwork in front of me. And it's all finished and the whole trust crap they've been doing is all signed, sealed, and delivered. Then I can get my own attorney if I have to go through it bit by bit and then come after them for what they basically stole from me. Not what they owe me or what I think I owe. Dad let me that and this and I had paid for my one acre in 92. I'm not asking for anything except what Dad said I was supposed to get, and I paid for what I have here around my home in 92, and I'm the only one that's even lived here and stayed here. Dad even left 25 years before he died. He went, well, about 22. When he, was, he, he left the farm. I'm the only one that's been here. Basically my whole life except for about six years. I'm the only one that lives here, and this is what they do to me. You know, and I told you about the well deal. Yeah. <laughs> I don't have no access to the well pretty soon. I'm sure and I have to dig my own well because uh, they made sure that wasn't in the trusty junk stuff that I have a right to use that well. But uh, Donnie sure got right to use a well way out there in the pasture where he has nothing to do with. But they wrote up the papers and they helped fudge them and I just hung loose. Eh, we'll have to work on that too. Who knows? But yeah, no deed yet. My taxes for next year going up. I own the ground, no deed. But I told him, I said, if if that certified stamp notarized deed date is before, and they're going to have to show me the records of when they took my money from Corey and put it in that trust again. If I had that, if that deed is certified and stamped before that date guess what that is basic fraud theft embezzlement federal offense i own the ground they can't have go to my renter behind my back or even if they told me and say you got to take ronnie's money and put it in this trust no once i have the deed of that ground what happens is that next year with my money is my money and then if i need to pay money i get my rent and stuff from whoever i rent it to and then i take my money and pay into the trust. They went and took my, my all my rent and everything and didn't even tell me. I found out. I finally got on Corey uh, in June. I said, oh, yeah, pretty soon I'm probably going to need my rent money. I already paid it. When? Oh, a month or so ago. They put it. Where did, what? Oh, yeah, they told me I had to put it in the trust again. Yeah, illegal as hell. I said, I... I, I have a feeling why I'm, they're still not giving me my deed. Because <laughs> I have proof here, and it's not going to be too hard to prove. If my rent money signed a check, Corey Daniels signed a check into Dad's trust to rent that ground, even, you know, if, it, if the seal is dated before that money went in the bank, they blatantly stole my rent and took it to cover their estate taxes and shit. And then, oh, once it's all gone again, then we'll just split it four ways, even though Rose is dead now. But yeah, after they take my taxes, I said would have been about $3,500 for last year on the ground. I would have paid. You take 48 acres at the same, plus a $160,000 house, yeah, that's pretty much going to take up all their freaking money, somebody's money, just to pay the taxes on it. Yeah? Get it? 
Mm, the old bait and switch and yo, yeah, but we'll put it in and then split it four ways after we take our cut and pay our estate taxes out of it. We'll give you a thousand maybe back, Ronnie. It ain't going to work that way. No matter what, if, if that was stamped, they owe me at least $6,500 freaking dollars. And then if my dad owned anything else on a trust, I'll have to take my cash and pay up a fourth of it. But they're using my ten grand to pay all their taxes and shit on, the, on, on their stuff and their electricity and the water and their estate taxes. Get it? Get it? Yeah. Well, I said, we'll see when I get the deed. Otherwise, if, I, if it's dated, if the deed is stamped and notarized after the date they took my rent money without even telling me, anybody, <laughs> and put it in that trust, all I can do then is hate them and bitch and tell the truth and maybe get a grand back after they paid all their taxes with my money. But yeah, there you go. But yeah. <laughs> so I'm just looking. I said it's cool. I own the ground, but I don't have a deed yet. <laughs> oh man my my transmission didn't show up at work today that shipped from billing so i got a little bit of working on stuff this week i'm going to do but my shoulder's still a little messed up so god's saying you need to take at least three-fourths of the day off saturday and sunday and just chill do your housework do a little work in the mechanicals on a couple of vehicles you got a little bit and Heal up, because a transmission will be here next week, and then you're going to have to get after it, so you don't want to be hurt and injured, and then working on something and then keep getting hurt. So I'm going to try to chill as much as possible this weekend, but get done what I need to get done. Peace. Love. Have a heart. So I'm holding my phone. Have a heart. I, I said, I, I, don't, I don't hide or... or I, yeah, I, I don't fuck with I don't care. Evil is evil. Illegal is illegal. People doing illegal shit behind the scenes and shit. I'm going to call them out. I'm going to show what's going on. Okay? I said, I have no authority whatsoever. In my, if, even if I call the attorney and say, hey, I'd like to see all the paperwork of when this was deposited. Legally, he doesn't, he doesn't have to show me because I'm not a trustee and I don't have power of attorney. I have to wait till it's all done. Then, but yeah, I, I have a feeling that's why I still don't have my deed. Cause I opened my mouth and said, if that money came out, <laughs> you took my rent money. After you already knew I own that ground, you all are in a lot of deep shit, and you're gonna pay my money back. I have a feeling that's what's going on. If I'm wrong, I'm wrong. But I have a feeling, and usually my feelings are right. I can feel evil. I can feel loving. I can feel caring. I can feel God and the angels, and I can feel death. And evil just, <clears throat> yeah, that, ah, it still sucks. You know, I said feeling death shit when it, no matter what, it, I said a mile away, I'd feel it, and I knew it right when it happened. And, ah, you know, that man, somebody, maybe his wife, kids, grandkids, He's never coming home again. He was just being a good Samaritan, trying to help this guy get his broke town vehicle off the freaking four lane when they're doing 70. And somebody else blasted into him. And he's the only one that died, and he had nothing to do with it. But he was a good Samaritan and a loving, caring human. And yeah, so say your prayers for Roger, I think is his first name. I can't remember the last name, but yeah, I still feel it. it it's been bugging me. I'm kind of been drug out, but that's part of being an old soul. You learn to live it, and you get used to it, but you never get used to it if you get my drift. All right, I love y'all. I'll be back. But yeah, there's info I got right now on on evil stuff going on around, or legal but really shady legal shit going on. And I said it shows I own. I own, oh, here, I can show you, here, here I, I circle here, here's, if you see that, right here, this is my dad's farm, this is my chunk here, and then there's a little two right up here that goes, if you go here and it says there's five acres right there, my little five right there, then my 39er here, this is all the pastures, the sister's gotten, and Donnie has all that in the middle with the big house and all that. Yeah, is that cool? I still don't have a deed, <laughs> and it's all in the box! <laughs> Oh, how convenient it is to lose stuff mistakenly.
<laughs> God's bless. Don't let shit eat you down. Stand up for yourself, but make sure you're correct before you make a stink. I'm just showing you the true info I have right now, and I have a feeling why. But we'll, we'll get it all sorted out one way or the other. I, I just don't have any power on anything. I just got to hang loose. And <laughs> I said, I'll have to go hunt for the information 10 to 1. But because I just wanted to stay out of it and be an innocent bystander and thought everything would be cool. Well, it ain't coming out real cool. But we'll get it worked out. I'm not letting it get me down. And I'm down to $220 on a, to being debt free, but it'll be uh, 180 because I'm going to make another payment of 40 bucks. It's only 20 bucks minimum, but I'm going to pay 40 But I had to pay 550 for the transmission. I have to pay $496 for three months for uh, homeowner's insurance on my house and my garage this weekend. And then I have to pay my real estate taxes uh, before the end of the month on my house here to the county. And I have to get some propane bought. Plus, if anything else blows up. <laughs> I don't worry, I'll get it. I'm rubbing it down slow, but sure. But I got to make sure I have enough money to pay everything else. And I ain't going to take nothing out of my savings. That's my emergency account. It's not getting touched. So, uh, it's working okay. Take care. God bless. Love you. Mwah! I'll be back if God and the angels let me. Ciao!